Hey, hey, hey guys, welcome back. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I am the Vaped Crusader. And if you like what I'm doing here, put a thumbs up. And if you don't, put a thumbs down. And please tell me why and what I can do better to improve this channel. All right, guys, today we are gonna be talking about this right here. Look at this beauty. This is Omboy OC's Rage mod. Yes, it's a squonker. We got another squonker. A manufactured by Desire Design goes up to 155 watts. So let's go ahead and take your first drag and we'll go below. Hey, 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 all right. Welcome below. So, this is the box and the packaging that the Rage Squonk Mod comes in by Homeboy and Desire Design. They have this crazy labeling here which he had to do it's just this little sheath that tells you everything on the back if you guys want to go ahead and pause it get all the information all right has a very simple homeboy oc logo there very beautiful and all the information for desire design let's go ahead and take it out boom baby here we go and this is the box that it comes in. It's a very beautiful box. I really like the packaging in this. I really like the foil lettering he has on there. It's very shiny. And even though some came off on mine, it's okay. Very nice, very simple. And then you have your scratch and sniff right here, which you can go ahead and go onto their website and make sure that it is what it is. All right. Okay, and these are the contents. You have your charging cable here and updatable firmware and you also have your user manual here for the rage squonk mod a warranty card and then it comes with a two of these plastic little mod shields so that you don't scratch your pretty little mod and then a homeboy sticker pretty cool very simple it also comes with a squonk bottle which i will show you on the mod all right and here she is the rage squonk mod i have the recoil rebel set on top because i did go to uh, the recoil rda.com and i pre-ordered this i've been using this for about a solid month now like i said i got the squonk bottle in there this is a proprietary squonk bottle so no other squonk bottles will fit in here as you can see it's meant to thumb fire as own boy would say and it has his logo up top nice desired design right here and as well as on the squonk bottle yes all right so it's five clicks to turn it on and off one two three four five desire design and there you go there's your screen layout and then one two three change work mode setting one two three and then you go ahead and you can exit through it, hands mode, exit menu, work mode. Let's go ahead and do that, power mode. And it has your nickel, temper temperature control, your titanium, and your stainless steel. And it has your curves and a bypass mode. And there's your power mode. I'm gonna go ahead and set that because I'm rocking the wattage. If it's not coming out so clear, the screen is pretty small and I apologize about that. But it's really simple to navigate, really easy. Nice fire button, fires up really quickly. You got your up, you got your down, and you got your move it all around. Now here is a squonk bottle. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead and flip this little thing upside down, pull this tab out, push in, twist, and pull, and it should come come out easily. I will go over some stuff up top about the squonk bottle and some of the things that I have encountered with, but to put it back in, you just go ahead and slide it in, push and twist, and then you can close it, and you can see it's nice and flush. Really simple and easy design, fits really well in the hands, um, and, and then that's just it. We'll go back up top, we'll vape it, and I'll tell you all of the pros cons and price about this. If you want me to go through the menu a little bit more in detail, just go ahead and put them in the comments down below and I will, but I just wanted to go ahead and just show you guys how to do this. It's a very simple and easy menu. If you know how to navigate menus, um, then this will be no chore for you. So let's go back up on top and we will talk about it. 
Hey, hey, hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back up top. I hope you guys enjoyed just that quick little view of this Rage Squonk mod by Mr. Ownboy and Desire Designs. Honestly, I really do appreciate everything he does for the community. This mod is amazing and it's beautiful. I love the finish on this. It was just a happy happenstance that I got um, this finish when I did order it. They were out of all of that stuff. They were out of the black on black, which I really wanted the black on black. Um, but Dwayne was awesome. He responded really quickly to my emails. And he he was just like, you know, if you wanted that one, you know, you would have to cancel your order and do this. But I'm really glad that I just went ahead and stuck with my gut and got this one. This one is beautiful. Now, let's talk about some cons. The con, the major con that I have with this mod are these squonk bottles. Now I know that he has rectified it and he's going to change it. He's going to come up with new stuff. But for the first time, I just bought the box and I bought the, the Recoil RDA, the combo off of RecoilRDA.com. And it only came with one squonk bottle. I, I feel like it should come with two. Um, just because, you know, if you want to, you know, change this out and change a different flavor, wash it out and all that. It's really simple, but what if you just want to just quick little recharge? Maybe you can, it comes with a little cap when you buy them separately that you can put it on. I don't know how well that holds up, but it holds up pretty well. So the problem that I had was I bought the first batch on the RecoilRDA.com and it had two O-rings up on one of the, the feeding ports that's up top here in the housing. And he did do a video with Grim Green to show you how to take off that second O-ring that's just basically just, it was useless. I mean, it stuck on there very well. I'm sure it wasn't useless, but that's where a lot of my problems came. So I came home that day after watching that video a couple of times. I opened up the mod and I took out that O-ring and now it's working perfectly. Um, the first bottle that I had was a little bit of a problem. Um, I actually tore it trying to get it out and I was just like was pulling from the bottom, pushing from it and it just tore. Um, this second bottle, as you guys can see, the bottom came off and you would have to basically unlatch it and unscrew it and reattach it. And every time I did that, like even with the fix, it just kept slipping off. And so I used my second one that I purchased. So that's three bottles. This is my third bottle. And this one's working perfectly fine. So the bottles are a con. Long explanation, the bottles were a con in the beginning, but I know he had a fix. I know he's trying to make good on that. The second con that I have on here is this thing does get hot because it is made out of a zinc alloy, especially if you're doing low builds on here and high wattages, this thing is gonna get hot. Now it's not like, ow, like, you know, extremely hot or anything like that. But that is one thing that I have noticed. Um, and another thing that's a little nitpicky con is that it can't house anything bigger than a 25 millimeter. If you have a 26 millimeter, it's gonna have some overhang. Not a big thing. You know, some people like their big atomizers. Honestly, anything 25 to 22 is good for me. I'm good with that. Um, but yeah, everybody seems to be liking this as I'm clicking around the internet. You can find it for about a hundred bucks depending on what website you use. Um, Vapor DNA has it for 99.99. So um, I'm sure you can find it for a yep, hundred bucks online and it'll be simple and easy. It's a beautiful mod. It comes in a variety of colors. It's just beautiful. I highly suggest either getting the black one or this brushed one. I mean, they have red, purple, white, whatever. Like, I mean, if you find if you find a color you like, I, I suggest getting it, even though it is a little bit on the expensive end, just for a squonk mod. But it is a dual battery 18650. I love, a, a, con, or a pro for me would be how it fits in my hand. It's just really simple and easy to fire. It's great. Um, I do like the weight of it. It doesn't, it's, it's heavier than the Pulse 80 watt, but the battery life lasts a lot longer since it is a dual 18650. 
Um, I just I just like it. It's a really good one. Like I said, the only con that I really do have are those bottles. But you know, since this thing has come out, Homeboy has been working day and night trying to make sure that it's good for us vapors and good for us consumers. So thumbs up to you, Homeboy. Um, I really do appreciate you, man. And I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. I did want to talk a little bit about advocacy. If you haven't filled out the FDA comments for flavors, please do so. Just put, you know, if it wasn't for a, you know, insert your favorite flavor there, um, I would I would still be smoking. You know, just tell them what flavor you got you off of cigarettes and how it's helping you and benefiting you now. They just want to hear from us. So go ahead and do that. I'll leave a link in the description. I'll leave a link in the description where you can buy this. Also to all my social media. If I've earned your subscription, go ahead and subscribe and we'll have more out later on. And thank you so much. And just remember, stay baked. Thanks guys.